Hello everyone and welcome to a new Service Tonic video. In this video, we will give you an overview on mobile devices. With Service Tonic, both agents and users can work with the application from anywhere at any time, thanks to the ability to add the application to their smartphone or tablet. This option is available for both iOS and Android. From an iOS device, we simply need to access our services URL via the browser. Once we've accessed it, we need to click on the action button and search for the option that says add to home screen. We click on add and as we can see, the icon has been successfully added to our mobile phone's home screen. Now with just one click, we can access our service. Next, we will show the process from an Android device. We access the services URL in the same way, press the Actions button, and then click on the option Add to Home Screen. As we can see, the icon has been added successfully. Finally, it's worth mentioning that this icon is fully customizable, meaning we can change it, for example, to our company's logo. By following these steps, as you can see, we can access Service Tonic with just one click. Now we log in with our credentials. Once logged in, we can see that the dashboard adapts perfectly to mobile device versions like this smartphone. We still have the same service options available as on a computer such as accessing the dashboard view and later performing an action on a ticket. Now, let's perform a test. As we can see, the dashboard adapts to our mobile phone, and if we want to access, for example, a widget from our dashboard, we can click on one of the widgets, go to the view, and click on one of the tickets. As we can verify, we have full access to the ticket along with its history. We can add a new action, attach files, or even a signature if needed. We also have access to our menu, just like on the desktop version, where we can view the saved views. And that's it for the mobile devices overview. For any questions, comments, or suggestions, feel free to contact our support team through the usual channels. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.